Welcome, everybody, to the Sentai Lane podcast. Uh, if you guys noticed, the 1 a.m.s have stopped, and that is because I'm not doing that anymore. I don't want to keep having to stay up to 1 a.m. to do that. Um, I don't want to have to try and get something out on the dot at 1 a.m. I want to make it a day specifically so that I can put it out any time and be fine because I, I don't, I don't want to box myself in like that. And I also want to condense this down to just one day because I don't want to have to force myself to put out videos every single day. I don't want to get to the point of burnout like that. So because these are being condensed down to one a, one a day, um, I am for now going to limit this to the weekly segments. But at some point, I'm going to start a show and I'm going to add it to the end of this. So what that means is... Boom, Boom Boongers, uh, Kamen Under Gav, and one other show, when I get to it, are going to be the shows I'm covering. So, you guys are going to be getting three shows at once instead of just one, so that way I don't have to do this, like, constantly, like, six or seven times a week. But, let's do a quick recap of, I've been calling it Bakuage because Boom, 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 it's, it's not easy to pronounce, so let's, let's have a recap of that basically this show is uh vehicle themed and the main character taya assembles a team of uh the the boom the boom boongers who consist of mira who he rescued from a relationship she didn't want to be in and uh who is his friend the the his his finance officer whose name i don't remember um, Joe, who was a police officer, and the guy who was procurement, whose name on, Genba is the finance officer, I just realized that, basically, he's, or, no, Genba's the scout, Genba's the redhead, and then the person who deals with finances, and basically procuring stuff for the team, I actually don't remember his name, um, there's also a robot who is voiced by Rika Matsumoto, who is like Bundario or something, and he, at least I think it's a he, he is basically the team mascot who cooks for the team, and he and Joe, not Joe, he and Taya, um, Taya rescued him when he was younger because he was in a race in space, yes, literally, and she crash landed on Earth, and uh, Taya basically nursed him back to health. So he basically putters around the base, and uh, monitors calls, cooks, cleans, and basically does whatever. So, like I said, basically the mascot. There is also Sakido, who was part is partnered with a purple robot whose name I honestly now can't remember. Um, I'm I'm gonna call him Natsuki because he's voiced by Natsuki. <laughs> Um, and he was in the same race as Bundario, and he also, uh, came to Earth, because I think he wanted to, to find Bundario and challenge him again, basically, and they kind of joined I mean, the team as a similar format, um, but not the same, because you know how there are different evolutions of rangers, and some of them might be might use a a different equipment to basic basically they they're also rangers but they use different equipment basically um there's also an ISA agent who weirdly has a crush on the robot um i i don't know how but she she says that she's a fan but it looks more like she has a crush on him which is very weird but yeah she is working for a company who's monitoring the aliens. And the villains this season are two very stupid aliens who, um... If I could equate them to something, basically, it would be Team Rocket. Because they kind of follow the heroes around, harass them, send monsters after them. But I love their personalities. I love their just, like, real dunces. It's really funny. But they also care about each other. And they care about the little car alien, um, and it's really cute, honestly. They, the, the, the first leader was Mad Rex, um, he got defeated, 
Then there was Kannenberg, who honestly was kind of a threat, but he got defeated. And now we're getting a new leader. And y'all, when I heard his voice, I'm like, oh my god, that is Shotaro Morikuma. I swear to god, that is him. That, that, please, please tell me I'm not wrong. Because he was previously in a movie, but he was barely there. And now we get him in an actual sh- Sentai show. And if y'all don't know, he is by far one of my favorite seiyus. One of, because the other one is Chu Fukuyama. But he is by far one of my favorite seiyus. And I am, I am beyond excited. I am so giddy. I squealed out loud when I heard his voice. And I'm like, <gasps> I, I, I also probably did audibly gasp. Because, like, he, he's so so much fun he's so loud and he's so like dramatic it's it's really really great um but yeah he is another uh leader who i think his name is dis race maybe they pronounce it in japanese it kind of sounds like death race which is funny um but yeah he's another uh, uh unit leader kind of like mad rex so it seems like there's more than one leader I'm guessing there's somebody above all of them. There's, like, a main villain we have not met yet. Because it feels like there's the commander, and then there are the underlings. Um, who, by the way, are also voiced by Junichi Suwabe and Nana Mizuki, who... They just, they make such a fun and stupid pair. It's really funny to watch. And unlike Don Brothers, they actually feel like they have personalities and, like... They're, th- I, I love them. They're so much fun. Um, but we get introduced to him next week. So uh, for now, I'm just this is this is a recap to to make sure y'all are all come to speed. And we are starting at episode twenty seven, starting next week. Oh, I forgot to add. Uh, we are going to be doing Common Writer Gav when that starts, and uh, probably. Common, either Common Rider Drive or uh, another Sentai series. I think we're gonna do Common Rider Drive because that's one of the one we're most inter- I'm most interested in seeing as of right now. Um, so there's there's that. If y'all have suggestions on what I should watch, I am absolutely open to suggestions. But I figured I should add that just in case anybody missed it. But now I'm officially signing off, and I will see you next Saturday.